Hello. In this lecture, we are giving a short overview of uh, different analytes what can be unstable. Firstly, acylglucuronide metabolites can be un unstable because of the hydrolysis of a parent drug and acyl group migration. Lactones can also be unstable because of a reversible hydrolysis to hydroxyl acid. Broad drugs can converse into the active drug by ester bond cleavage. Oxidative compounds can degrade by oxidation. Amides can uh, degrade by hydrolysis to acids. Cytostatic nucleosides can uh, degrade by enzymatic uh, termination. Diols can uh, degrade by demerization. Enantiomers can form a resonate. And cis and trans isomers can interconverse over the time period. Moreover, there is a large group of antibiotics called beta lactams. All of those antibiotics are penicillin derivatives. Those antibiotics can uh, degrade by hydrolysis, enzymatic degradation, oxidation, and presence of uh, metal ions. Let, it, let us see now more closely of two examples of the decomposition of those antibiotics. Firstly, the antibiotic called uh, meropenem which has the beta-lactam ring, is known of its instability uh, when the temperature is increased. The stability tests were uh, conducted in two different uh, temperatures. At first, the stability at uh, plus 20 degrees in autosampler was evaluated and uh, over the five-hour period, the rapid degradation of meropenem occurred and only approximately 60% of meropenem was left to the sample. When the autosampler temperature was lowered to 4 degrees, then the meropenem samples over the same time period were more stable. Secondly, the second antibiotic, well-known penicillin G, was evaluated and the effect of a pH was studied. In two very close pHs, 6.2 and 7, over the 16-hour time period, penicillin samples uh, acted almost completely differently. When the pH was uh, 6.2, the rapid degradation after the 16 hours, leaving only 20% of uh, penicillin to the samples, was detected. When the pH was increased to 7, then the stability was improved and the stability of uh, those samples uh, was approximately 80% after 16 hour time period. This was the short introduction to possible analytes that can be unstable in the solutions.